Thanks for tuning in to WSKI TV 17. It's time once again to take a check of your latest local forecast brought to you by 45 North. Check them out in the Sugarloaf Mountain Hotel for some great breakfast, apre, as well as dinner year-round to get you fueled up for your outdoor adventures. And you can find this and much more at our website, WSKITV.com, on all of your internet devices. Well, for the day on Thursday, looks like it's going to be a wet one. So uh, we've got some rain in the forecast, chance of thunderstorms as well. Rain could be heavy at times, calling for some calmed wind except for when those storms roll through. 72 to 76 will do it for your high temperatures, 60 to 64 for your overnight lows. And then things will clear out for Friday, looking like a great day, partly sunny skies for most of the day. After 5 o'clock, we should see some showers roll in to our area as well, so want to be aware of that Friday uh, later in the day. Calm wind becoming south around 5 miles an hour, and warm temperatures warming up to right around 82 degrees for your high temperatures and lows overnight on Friday, getting down into the lower 60s. As far as the weekend goes, looking like a great one. Partly sunny skies, a 40% chance of showers, highs of 77 degrees with an overnight low of 58 degrees. Sunday, mostly sunny skies, and we've got temperatures topping out in the mid to upper 70s once again, and 56 for your overnight low, and partly sunny skies for the day on Monday. So looking like a great stretch of weather ahead after Thursday for any outdoor activities here in the main High Peaks region. If you're looking for some indoor activities, the anti-gravity complex right at the bottom of the access road has a lot to offer down there 237-5566 is the number down there and the Sugarloaf Sports and Fitness Center as well they've got hot tubs swimming pool weight room racquetball courts massages as well as a cafe with some adult beverages and whatnot so if you want to go down there and do some indoor activity that's where you'll want to head Carabasa Valley Outdoor Camp Adventure Camp is still happening and you can sign your kids up for uh, a single day or the whole week happens right down at the Carabasset Valley Town Park and you can and find out more at the Carabasa Valley website. Bowling lanes, virtual golf, and arcade, that's great on a rainy day as well. Down at the Sugar Bowl, they open up at 4 o'clock. Also, the rack right at the bottom of the access road. They've got some great live music happening on the weekends, as well as Chase's Trivia on Thursdays, Open Mic on Wednesdays. They've got great food down there, great apre, great atmosphere, so go check it out check out the rack and if you are out on the lake want to stop by for a bite to eat check out the stratton plaza and hotel they've got a marina right out the back you can park your boat and head over there for some great atmosphere and great eats as well if you want to get involved with the atv trails up in uh stratton and eustace they could really use your help you can go to flagstaffatvclub.com for more information on that and we want to let you know to check out our quad cam if you're want to uh interested looking at the weather seeing how things are up here go to our quad cam right on our website and you can see some live video as well as a snapshot uh, in real time and some weather information to see what's happening right here at the base of the mountain in real time and you can find us on social media as well facebook twitter and instagram and as always at our website wskitv.com for this latest local forecast and tons of videos of things to do to keep you busy each one of those a reason to stay another day